Hi everyone, this is Mike from Ultimate Black Belt Guitar. I'm here to tell you the truth about taking guitar lessons. Uh, some people come up and ask me, you know, should I be taking lessons or should I just try to learn on my own at first? And my advice is always to try to get with somebody who knows what they're doing and uh, learn the fundamentals at first. So here at Ultimate Black Belt Guitar, we're here to show you those fundamentals so that you're able to take even a little bit of knowledge at first and expand it to many different areas. Uh, at first, a lot of people are really stuck on, I want to play this style of music for the rest of my life, maybe rock or country or metal. And I always tell them that if you learn the basics first and you learn them the correct way, you'll be able to apply that to any style that you choose now or down the road. And it saves you a lot of time and it makes you very flexible so that no matter what situation you're in, you're able to play something and actually sound good. It's a great feeling. So what I'm going to show you is that you can take several styles and uh, take one basic scale and play it over the top and make it work for several different styles once you know what you're doing. Uh, I'm going to, you know, add a few different notes here and there, but my basic idea is going to be all based around what's called a minor pentatonic scale. So we'll be showing you that with several different styles, and you'll see that knowing your basics can really pay off. All right, we're going to be using one fundamental scale for all the different styles coming up, and here's what it's going to be. The A minor pentatonic scale. I'll play it all the way through so you can see how simple it really is. Notice my index finger played the same fret the entire time, and my whole hand stayed in the basic, basically in the middle of the guitar right here. I'll do that one more time. Now when you really take lessons, I'll be teaching that to you much slower and I'll be explaining all the notes that we're using, uh, but for now I just wanted to give you a feel for what the scale sounds like before we put it into action. So that's it, the E minor pentatonic scale, and here's what it sounds like when used in different styles. <laughs> 